Take a moment to imagine what your own private hell might look like. Got an image? Well, in the opening scene of this book, our main character, Seth, drowns and dies. A rather intensely portrayed drowning, I might add. And note that this is not the worst of it. He's bewildered to awaken unclothed, starving, and thirsty in a bizarrely unpopulated and dusty world that is somehow familiar to him. Turns out it's his childhood home in England, where he lived before the family moved to America, and he's about to face his own private hell. Interestingly, it has taken his own death to get him to confront his demons. Whenever Seth closes his eyes in this strange world, troubling past events haunt him in nightmares. These dreams include his family, the boy he loves, and past traumas. The reader shares the oddity of the situation and wonders whether Seth is in heaven, hell, or a fully reborn life. What the heck is happening? Is he really alive? More Than This by Patrick Ness, Candlewick Press, 2013. Book Talk by the New Hampshire Flume Committee.